Hey everybody, what's up and welcome back to today's video guys. And today guys, I will be showing you how to center a button in your website in Bathflow. So yeah guys, make sure to watch this quick and easy video till the very end and follow my steps correctly. So you can make sure this works the same for you and that you can do this yourself. But yeah guys, let's get straight into it. The first thing you want to do guys is go ahead and open up the official webflow.com website right here and log into your account. After logging in to your account guys, you'll be greeted by this main page right here where you can see all of the options that you can access in Webflow. You can see, I can see all of the websites that I have created right here and here I even have a button to go ahead and create a new website if I want. But for today's video guys, I'm going to be using this website right here that I have created called YouTube Tutorials. So I'm going to go ahead and open up the website by clicking on it right here and clicking on Open Designer. After clicking on Open Designer guys, this will now open up the website and the page and I can get started with editing it. If you look at the left and right side of the screen, you will see multiple options for editing your website. At the left side of the screen, you can go ahead and add new elements to your website, you can see your components, you can see your website settings and so on. And the right side of the screen, you can use those elements and edit and style how they look on the page. You have the style option, here you have element settings and so on. So let's go back to the website. What we want to do to be able to first add a button is go ahead and click on this plus button in the upper left corner and then click on the button that we want to add. Click on button and this will add a button to the website. So as you can see, I have already created a button right here. It is called link to CMS. So now I'm going to go ahead and center the button. What we want to do is go ahead and click on the button right here and we have multiple options that we can do. As you can see, we can first have the option to click right here on the layout and click this option right here. That will, that will make the button larger. We do not want this. What we want to do is go ahead and find this position right here and click on static. We want to change it to relative. Click on relative, guys, and now you can go ahead and move the button wherever you want. So, as you can see, we have currently made the button much larger. We do not want it to be this way. But, as you can see, after making the button uh, uh, static and turning it to a uh, horizontal, now we can go ahead and see uh, that we can go ahead and put a relative. And now we can go ahead and move it right here to the center of the page. So, now we can move it wherever we want. As you can see, up and down, we can move it to the center page. And after you're satisfied, guys, let's say we want to leave it right here. After you're satisfied, just exit out and click anywhere. And now the button will be automatically saved and it will be centered in the page. So, you guys, basically, that's how you do it. I hope this video was helpful. If it was, make sure to leave a like and subscribe to the channel. So, guys, thanks for watching. Take care and bye.